Katie is on the phone. I don't believe I've ever talked to Katie. I don't know. Katie, how's it going, Katie? Hey. Now, have you ever called into the Poorly Played stream? No, this is my first time. Oh, well, congratulations. Thank you for calling in. Oh, yeah, I'm excited. Right on. And you were uh, you were at game days, is that correct? I wasn't. Oh, no. Different Katie? Are you thinking of a different Katie, Kevin? Well, thank you nonetheless, and maybe game days 2014, we'll see you there. Yes, I'm, I'm going to try. <laughs> so, hey, uh, how are you doing? What uh, what can we help you with today? I'm good. Um, I'm playing GTA right now. Oh, I'm envious. They gave you a half a million dollars. Hell yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> what kind of cruise are you in? You in any cruise? I'm in a crew. I was actually going to ask you about your crew because I want to join your crew. You want Send me an invite to Instrumentality Now. And I will add you to the crew. Post -haste. Instrumentality now? Yeah. Okay. It's uh okay. you could you can find instrumentality now. I N S T R U M E N T A L I T Y uh N O W. I think okay. uh, it's all one no, it's two words. I don't exactly but, remember how that works with uh the GTA. Uh... Right oh, now, in, in one crew, it's like me and my brother and his fiance and stuff. It's uh, Seven Deadly Sins, but gotcha. it's nothing big. <laughs> well, uh, Eric, as well, has Pizza Club. I think uh, Jake oh. has a gaming cult podcast, that GCP Illuminati logo. Um, I know that, uh, I think, who, who, who else has one? Does Rob have one, too? I can't think of the name of it. I'm joining it. I know Alex Hanley's got one, uh, um, Super Robo something. I, uh, there's a ton of crews. You can only be a member of five, and I only play in mine, so I don't really even know what the... Uh, I mean, I get, like, having more than one makes sense, but okay, now I'm yeah. not going to push that into the wall. Well, I messaged you on Facebook, so if I can't find you. Okay. If I'm you... Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll check my messages, and I'll, I'll get back to you uh, sure. tomorrow, most likely. Thank you. Yeah, well, I, I've i been having so much fun with GTA Online, and I wish I had more time to play it. And, uh, man, I've been waiting for that paycheck to come in. It's like <laughs> yeah, getting, it's, it's, it's like, great. it's like just being on welfare. The government just gives you free money. It's great. <laughs> I'm too white for free money. Can we, well, that's subtly racist, <laughs> but we're going to let it slide. Uh, <laughs> I am so happy you called in. Uh, what else have you been playing? I know you got that GTA going. Um, not a whole lot lately. I've been just working all the time, but, uh, I just got GTA. I wasn't really into it at first, but then I started playing with, like, my brother, and it was just like, I don't know. It, it grew was on you. I just had to get it. Well, I don't blame you, man. It, it, it's a lot of fun, and, and... I wasn't going to pick it up when I first did. GTA has always been a game where it's like, ah, uh, I think I'm going to pass Same on thing. it this year. And then when mm -hmm. it comes out, all I hear is like such rave reviews that I got to go out and get it. Yeah. I like the amount of customization in like Saints Row. Yeah. I kind of missed that in GTA 5. Yeah, they haven't really put out a lot of like clothing options and stuff especially for online and i keep hearing yeah. that stuff's coming like they can always add stuff to the stores and give us a wider selection uh hopefully yeah <laughs> hopefully because i yeah i'm, I'm kind of already bored with how my character's dressed and that was just <laughs> basically the i've got her dressed in the stuff that they made available right when the game uh when you start yeah yeah i'm pretty much sticking with like what i started with as well yeah <sighs> All right, right on. well, I have some uh, Resident Evil questions, because yeah. I love Resident Evil. So do I. Let's answer them. All right. Uh, do you have any uh, Resident Evil crushes? Is there any character that you're just, like, obsessed gotta, with? i got to give it up to uh, Jill Valentine. Yeah? Um, I think she was looking bang tidy in that tube uh, tube top <laughs> and miniskirt with the white sweater wrapped around and the, and the, and the boots. <laughs> the boots all the way up to the kneecap. That's in three, right? Oh, yeah. That's, that's in three. It's a good look. Resident Evil 3, Jill. That's a that's a good look. Um, I would. Who else? Who else? Uh. Uh. uh well, Alexia Ashford, the blonde girl mm, from Code Veronica. Yeah. You know. Uh. Who? Who? All of the 
of the leading ladies of the Resident Evil franchise, I think, have been, you know, fairly attractive. Yeah. I've had a crush on, I got Jill and I got Wesker. Oh, you got, you're a Wesker gal. Yeah. <laughs> Wesker seems like if uh, people on the internet would draw him shirtless, he'd be very smooth chested. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, if, if Wesker and Chris were in Yaoi, I think Chris is a much wider frame. I think... I've actually seen some of the Yaoi for oh, have... Chris and Wesker, and it's very awkward. Oh, have you? It's very yes. awkward. I remember <laughs> downloading on... This is a fucking memory that just came flooding back. I remember downloading an, an MP3 on Morpheus or Kazaa or Napster, one of those, when, it, when they were, like, first coming out, of... <laughs> Someone took all the sound clips from Resident Evil and made it like uh, all the characters having sex, oh. and all the all the zombie biting moans and stuff were like, Jill, oh Barry, here I've got this. Oh Barry, it was like so bad. It was just zombie moaning, and it was it was uh it was very interesting i i don't remember exactly what i thought it was when i was downloading it or maybe it was actually just i was so curious because it was like what's a resident evil porn like what could this that's be weird it was weird. weird i've seen some weird like hentai that's like jill fucking like oh sorry um oh did you swear <laughs> yes i did I'm oh sorry. don't don't <laughs> apologize we encourage you can say fuck, you can say piss, you can say shithead. This All is the right. internet. You can do whatever. She was fucking a zombie, and it's weird. I don't know. It, it just disturbed me. That is disturbing. They're un <laughs> It's an undead creature. Mm -hmm. What do you guys think? Zombie sex, is it good or is it bad? So and do it. Down yeah, Jin oh. says down with necrophilia. I gotta agree with him. What does Kelly say? How does that even work? That's. I like... don't know. How do you, like, get... I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I, I dated a girl who said some interesting things on the podcast once a uh, long time ago about uh, necrophilia and zombies in general. <laughs> Kevin, you remember that? I do remember that. Yeah. She was a she was an remember, interesting girl, uh, I woman. I remember that. Uh, but <laughs> Kelly, how about any do you have any other Resident Evil questions Katie. for me? Katie. Katie. Okay, um, yeah, yeah. Um <laughs> no, maybe too. some comments though. And um, maybe not questions though. Is that all right? That oh, more than all right. Comments. I feel like questions. Oh, right. They're all appreciated. I feel like Resident Evil has been a really big part of my life. It's uh, it's kind of how my brother and me bonded. Really? Like I was a really little kid when Resident Evil Two came out, and he just, just like to play that for me. Like that was my request that he play that game for me. That's awesome. And uh, let's see. Leon B. I think, the, is that the one where Nemesis is, like, chasing him? Uh, Mr. X you're talking about? Yeah, you're Mr. X, that's it. Yeah, I believe so. Well, I think he chases you no matter what Leon scenario you Oh, pick. really? I thought it was, like, A and B was different. I don't know. Oh, no, okay, maybe on. that'll happen when I'm with Claire, then. I Leon really B, you're right. I love the part where you're looking in the camera. Uh, Leon's looking in the camera, and you see Mr. X coming up behind you. Oh, shit. Oh, that scared the shit out of me. Crazy. Oh, Already God. <laughs> um, and and now, earlier today, I bought a new... We haven't shown this off now. Let's cut... Let, we're going to do a little tech review. We could do a little uh, tech music. Here. <laughs> Boom. Look at this. Uh, recently purchased for the Poorly Played Stream, we've got a brand new Nandy MM242 mixer here. So we can control separate audio channels. Coming in. We can turn stuff up, we can turn stuff down, we can check all the levels. Uh, and I needed a 9 volt battery. And that's what I'm getting at. That beep I keep hearing. Girl, you gotta find yourself a 9 volt battery because you have a smoke detector that is low. Yep. I was and what would, what would happen if a fire broke out in your house? And you couldn't protect you. You wouldn't even know. You might just die of asphyxia. I'd just die. In I'd the night. Die. So after we get off the phone, I'm, you got to go down. What I did is I went over I went over to Derek's desk, and I took a piece of electronics. He's got this noisemaker thing, and it takes 9-volt batteries, and I stole that battery <laughs> right out of it. And I, I put it in the mixer here, and no one's going to know because he doesn't watch this. He, yeah. When was the last time he turned it on? Who even knows? 
I might I, I might as well just take it out of that bobblehead right there. But um, Katie, I'm gonna recommend uh, a replacement nine volt for you. Uh, oh, thank you. That's I think that's what we gotta go with. All right. Well, thank you very much for calling in. I'm glad that we got to uh, learn about the bonding between a brother yeah. and sister. You know? <laughs> Resident Evil is something that's... It's not all gore. I know this it game... It brings families together. It, it really does. It really does. And it says... It, there's there's the warning at the beginning. This game it includes explicit violence and gore, but also uh, a little bit of love and some happiness. It's the wrong clip. I didn't mean to play that clip. Oh, okay. You know what, Katie? I keep hearing that. You got to get to that girl. What? I don't know what you're talking about. You're, I don't know. You don't hear that beep in your house? Uh, no. You're crazy. There's okay, a high I pitched beep. There, I do have some um, some alarms that need batteries, but I don't hear it right now. Maybe I maybe I have a tumor. I don't know. I'm crazy. Every like sixty seconds, there's a. No way. I, I swear to God. Just is. just stand in the room and listen, and then you'll go, okay. oh, I need a 9-volt battery for the smoke detector. <laughs> I can guarantee well, you. I bet you it's a Kitty brand smoke detector. Uh, there it is. it is. You hear it? Yeah, we just heard it. Oh, okay. Count to 60 right now, and you'll hear it again. We sure do love you. We'll see you next time, Katie. Thank you for answering me. Thank you. We'll see you next Have week. Nice night. Good night. She's got. I'm very worried. This is a great call. She's gonna have problems with uh, yeah. with that smoke detector. If she doesn't get that fixed, you know, carbon. It could be carbon oh, right, monoxide detector. Yeah. Could even be a carbon monoxide detector. We don't know at this point. Um, I am so sidetracked to where I'm supposed to go. I'm gonna check.